All right, big, big news. Carl and Lindsay have ended their engagement. Yeah. Lindsay just had her bridal shower two weeks ago. Yep. They were going to get married Carly in Mexico. Carly came and surprised her. Yeah, she did write that in her, in yeah. her caption. Um, they were getting married in Mexico, in a venue in Mexico, very soon, in the fall. Yeah. And it has been called off. Now, this is so crazy for a ton of reasons. I mean... I think, including themselves, they wanted it to work out for the sheer fact that so many people hated on them, including the people they were surrounded by, and they just couldn't make it work. And I am dying to know the details. I'm really dying to know the details around this, but apparently it was all filmed. Yeah, so Entertainment Tonight was the first one to report this. They said, um, Carl and Lindsay have called off their engagement. The two were set to get married in November, but Carl told Lindsay he couldn't move forward with the wedding. The breakup was filmed and will most likely play out on the next season of Summer House. So that's fucking wild. Crazy. I just like, I have so many questions. Um, I will say that I did see this rumbling ha- start Wednesday night. I came across the TikTok of a woman who was like, I'm hearing things about Carl and Lindsay that there was maybe something that is there, the engagement might be over. Don't have too many details yet. Um, and honestly, before we even really had a chance to dig into it a little bit more, uh, this n- article came out, like mm-hmm. the news broke on online. So like now everybody's talking about it. The Bravo Instagram accounts, everybody started posting. They're saying, no, our sources, reliable sources, people are saying, this is the thing with Bravo that I do love, is that when shit hits the fan like this, the other Bravo people love talking about it you know so it's like bravo's and like, bravo cocktails and like all those accounts like best of bravo like they have people that they reach out to and like people start talking and mm-hmm. things happen but as of right now it seems like this is all we know um and it's just i can't decide what i'm more shocked about or if i'm just like not shocked at all but everything about their relationship has played off played uh, played off like on camera right mm-hmm all these big moments, they've all been filmed, they've all been a part of the show. We saw in the reunion, like the other girls saying like everything they do is planned and contrived and everything. So like at first shock and then like my radar is up of like, ooh, like what's, I don't, like would they go this far? I don't think they I would. Don't I think, think that so. would be pretty I crazy. I think that would be pretty crazy. Um, but it is like for Carl to do it on camera feels way more hurtful than having it happen privately. I totally agree. And no matter what you feel about Lindsay, it just feels crazy to me that people who were about to get married, the way that she would find out that they are no longer getting married is on camera. Like I would think that's a a private conversation that then gets brought to camera, but the initial conversation being on camera is so crazy to me. I do not think they would go that far to gain money and and whatever. Like I think the public humiliation is just not worth that. Do it for the pot. Um, I am so intrigued because we I have seen that Lindsay has been hanging with those girls a lot more like making TikToks with them at the house and it, from the outside looking in it seemed like things were okay. Yeah. And I just uh, we're going to need to know more details. But the crazy thing is, it's like, we're not going to know until until Summer House premieres. And that won't be till the winter. Like, it's going to be a yeah. long time before we get Summer House. Now, BravoCon is coming up in the fall. True. And, you know, I think that things will come from that. They're going to be talking. People are going to know that they split up. I just want to know, what, like... Yeah. I just want to know details. Right. I'm feeling it's like, really, where did this come from? I'm feeling so nosy about this one. I know. I'm feeling super nosy about this one. Where did it come from? How did this conversation start? Like, if it was on camera, like, did they have? Did Lindsay have any idea? Like, did, did, did were they having issues? Like, what was going on? Like the bridal shower being two weeks ago. Yeah, I know. Because if you get in a big fight, right, in the, in the next yeah. two weeks, like you would think you try to work it out before you get married. This something had to have been happening for a while. Also, if you call off a wedding. Totally. I also kind of thought that even if they were having issues, that they would get married and then figure it out. Mm-hmm. Just because, like, 
for the moment. Mm. And I know that sounds like really, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Dark? Starts with an S. Cynical? No. That starts with a C. Yep, it does. Um, can't really think of the word that I want to use here, to be quite honest. Feels really sinister. Shallow. Shallow. Shallow, Shallow. is the word I was looking for. That, like, if they. <laughs> good. Yeah, good we, word. We made it. Um, <laughs> that they would go about it this way. But I don't know, ever since, like, Ever since the reunion and really like the more of the discussion of like how planned their stuff is, th- things like that has just made me look at them a little bit differently, like mm-hmm. as a couple. And not that I didn't think that they were a couple. I just think that in the realm of almost a Tom and Ariana, like they're creating a brand for themselves, like together kind of thing. So it's like, oh, Carl and Lindsay, yes, they are getting married. Yes, they are a couple. Yes, they are together. They're doing all these things. But they they also see themselves as like a business mm-hmm. and that they would like get married and, and, and try and figure everything out. I, and this is just my own personal opinion of, of how I've watched them and how like my opinion of how I think their relationship is. Could be totally wrong, but it's not, you know, it's not crazy now looking back and thinking like how people were like, ooh, I don't, is this all happening really fast? Like what's going on? I don't know. I just feel like Carl may have jumped into this all mm-hmm. and now it's all hitting him like that maybe he's got to slow it down a little bit. Yeah, maybe. Because weirdly enough, most times when a couple, you would think when a couple comes calls off an engagement, in my mind, I don't, I'd be like, oh, there's no coming back from that. You know, mm-hmm. with them, I could kind of see, like, down the line, them being I don't together. know. If, if he ended things on camera for the first time when they right. were going to get married. No, yeah, it's true. Maybe it's they're true. just not it for each other. Yeah, yeah. Maybe that's just not it. I do feel bad for Lindsay. Like, if this really did go down mm-hmm. like that. And if she didn't know or and and this all happened just like on camera, that fucking sucks. That sucks. Like, oh, my God. That's such a private moment. It's like if that was the first time, you know, I would assume that maybe there was conversations leading up to that because I don't know if that just happens for the first time like that. But, man, I mean, we're going to have to know more details. But I think we will get them with BravoCon coming up. Summer House won't air for a while, but you know that, yeah, that cast. And, and there will be more there, people are going to. There will be start more talking. stories coming out for sure. Definitely. Other people will start talking, and and honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if Lindsay says something herself. You know, mm-hmm. so one of them's going to have to. Yeah. 